I'm about to, I'm, 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 we, we've done our beginning. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is your girl, Love. Welcome to Life with Love. I am back with another video about fragrances. <laughs> but stay tuned because I do have a Mother's Day cooking recipe coming up. This is a spring fragrance video. If you guys want to know what fragrances are, if you guys want to know what my bombshell spring fragrances are, stay tuned for my faves. So if you guys are new to the channel, first of all, let me say hello to my new subscribers. If you guys have never been here before, my name is Love. I am a lifestyle brand. Let me just say that out loud. Just a whole brand, okay? What you see is what you get. What we get is an upfront, in-your-face kind of girl. We talk about fragrances over here. We talk about fashion a little bit. We talk about cooking a little bit. We talk about lifestyle, okay? That's what we talk about over here. And every now and again, you might get a little something extra from your girl. But if that sounds like something you're interested in, please stay tuned because I have a lot to bring in 2021 and beyond. So what are we talking about today, guys? Today, we are talking about my favorite bombshell fragrances. These are not in any particular order. They are the fragrances that have been in constant rotation in my life over the last few days, weeks, and months. Um, and they are the ones that right now are current heavy hitters, but it doesn't mean that you can't wear them. You can just wear them for spring. I'm giving you some ones to enter into spring in case you don't have either of the, I can't even say either because it's not like an either or, either or. It is a, if you don't have any of these fragrances, you can think about adding some of these to your collection. Now, let me say this. I am not getting ready to tell you to go run out here and grab all these fragrances and spend all your coins. Get you samples if you don't have the fragrances and then go from there. But I will tell you this. I am not going to lead you down a path of just telling you to spend all of your money to go and buy stuff that you don't need or things that you can get a smaller sample of and, you know, just overdo your budget. I'm not telling you to go out and do that at all. I definitely believe in decants now. I definitely believe in smaller samples because it is worth it. It allows you to experience more with the fragrances and... It allows you to build a better wardrobe when it comes to fragrances, a better fragrance wardrobe. Can fragrances be a wardrobe? Is that the technically, is that the politically correct word? Is it a fragrance wardrobe? Mine is in my wardrobe, so hmm, I'm going to think about that one for a minute. But anyway, they're not in any particular order. They are <laughs> just some of my spring bombshells right now when I say bombshells love what does that mean it means that I have gotten compliments on it from work I have gotten compliments on it from a babe I have gotten compliments on it from strangers that means that it has made an impact when I've worn it to someone else's life like what do you have on oh you smell good girl what is that called again okay let me send you a link like it has made it into my body cream collection and candle collection because it is that significant in our lives so let's just so if that sounds like something you're interested in you want to know what my spring bombshell fragrances are then stay tuned y'all ready to get into the video all right let's go let's start with number one i am going to start with the i can't say it's the heaviest hitter but it's my favorite heavy hitter right now okay it's my favorite heavy hitter right now and that is going to be none other than jimmy choo's i want chew It's a goodie. I did a whole fragrance review. I will link it in the description box below. It is a goodie, okay? It's a goodie. It is so much of a goodie that she has made it into the Love Davis Home tab of my website. This, it comes in a four ounce cream and a four ounce, uh, eight ounce cream. It is called He Stole my chew where did i get that from sex in the city of course i mean I, everything has a playful word in my life i can't just say jimmy choose i want you because i didn't make jimmy choose i want you however in my body cream that is bomb.com it is called he wants he stole my chew so four ounces eight ounces go over and get it you won't be sorry i want you number two on my list is going to be Marc Jacobs Perfect. 
I cannot tell you a better fragrance to wear in the spring as you are starting to peel off layers than Mark, Mark Jacobs Perfect. It is a work fragrance. It is a, it, uh, let me just say this. All of these are all day, every day, no matter what the situation is. These are all those fragrances, okay? They fit every category. This bombshell, it's like fresh, clean, and sexy. Fresh, clean, and sexy. So if you want to do a fresh, light, clean fragrance, but you still want to smell sexy, you still like, hey, I'm about it, about it. Hey, I like myself. I am here for it. Marc Jacobs Perfect. It is amazing. So amazing, of course. <laughs> it is called The Perfect Mark over on lovedavis.com. Calm. All you have to do is click on the love home. You will see the body cream and you will see the candles. The candle for this is not available just yet, but this does come in a four ounce and an eight ounce body cream. Okay. The perfect mark from Marc Jacobs. Number three is going to be none other than Gucci Bloom. <laughs> Floral. Oh, love Gucci Bloom. It took me a while. So if you don't know my story about Gucci Bloom, I hated it, loved it, hated it. My grandmother stole it. I had to get it again, but I didn't get it. My kids ended up buying it for me um, for Christmas. So every Christmas I always ask for a fragrance, no matter what the go-to is always a fragrance. Gucci Bloom. This is the original Eau de Parfum. It is an amazing. This is the 50 ml bottle. It is absolutely amazing. It is not too strong. It is not too overpowering. Overpowering. Why can't I speak today? Overpowering. It's not too overpowering. It is a bomb.com. I would say this is one of those ones that you're going to have to get a sample and see if you love it. Like Marc Jacobs is a safe buy. Jimmy Choo is a safe buy. This you're going to definitely want to get a sample to see if you like it. I'm not going into the fragrance notes, but it is bomb.com. Number three is going to be Gucci Bloom. I will say this as a disclaimer. There is a Gucci Bloom body cream that I cannot remember the words to right now. But there is there's a body cream over on... Um, over in lovedavis.com it's a little bit more subtle than here than the actual fragrance but it smells amazing and so i digress but there is a gucci bloom fragrance available body cream available over on lovedavis.com number four is going to be all right something something shaking up in here i don't know what i did but i dropped her a couple times it's going to be none other than carolina herrera's good girl y'all already know who who got to say anything about Good Girl? If you need a sample of Good Girl, girl, it's a safe buy. It's a safe blind buy. Good Girl is amazing. I also have a body cream of Good Girl. Um, Good Girl is almost, it, it, it reminds me a little bit of like Gucci Bloom in that kind of soft, subtle category where it's like not overly powering. There's no like particular note that's over, overly strong. It is a nice, subtle, sexy fragrance. Like, it just is. It, 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 it's not anything that's way stronger than the other. It is just very, very subtle and sexy. I have a video about Good Girl over on my channel. It is... Oh, I wish I could have... I have on something else today that's in this video, so I cannot spray it uh, on myself. But it is super, super, super gorgeous. So this is definitely a spring heavy hitter. This is actually an all year round for me heavy hitter. But it definitely works better in the spring and summer. So my number four is going to be Carolina Herrera's Good Girl. Oh, do I have a good girl? I don't. These right here are the older, um, my older, this is where I started ironically enough this is how I started and this is how the packaging is looking right now so we are stepping up the brand but those are mine that I keep in rotation all right number five what are we doing for number five <laughs> number five is a fresh clean beautiful scent that will make it into the body cream collection I just haven't done it yet it is in sample stages and that is none other than Bulgari's Omnia Crystalline 
Y'all, I love Crystalline. It is so fresh, clean, but it has that little hint of sexiness. It almost kind of falls into that category. Not as strong as a Gucci Bloom. Um, not as over, not as powerful as as um, Good Girl. But if I, if Good Girl was the mother, then the way that Omnia Crystalline kind of punch packs that punch is going to be the the daughter. If that makes sense. Like it's a little powdery. It's a little um let me pull up a fragrance note in crystalline i i did an omnia crystalline go back in my channel and watch the video but there's an omnia collection where i've, I've done crystalline crystalline has definitely grown on me yeah so you can definitely smell the citrus notes in here with the pear there's definitely pear in here. Um, it's got a little bit of a tea note, but then it dries down to a musk. And oak moss, but it's very light and subtle. Like, I don't always love oak moss. Oak moss can be extremely strong, i.e. like the oak moss, oak moss that's in, um, I think Chloe Nomad to me is like very, very, very like in your face. But either or, I digress. Uh, Bulgari's Omnia Crystalline to me is a heavy hitter. I know it's not a powerful like slat long lasting all day long but somebody's gonna ask you damn you like you smell really like fresh and light and clean like what do you have on this would be that category for me moving on to number six number six is going to be i need a new bottle a whole new bottle jimmy chews illicit i love it i'm a jimmy chew I, i'm a jimmy chew whore like i love jimmy chew period Jimmy Choo is one of my favorite brands. I love Illicit. I have Illicit and Illicit Flower. Jimmy Choo's Illicit. Illicit. You see how much I got left? Like, days worth. Like, a few days worth, and I'm done. I love it. If you haven't tried it, for, first of all, it's a good discount fragrance. So, when I say discount fragrance, I mean those fragrances that only cost $40, $50. Like, you're not going to overdo your budget. You can definitely get this. I want to say for $39.99 from like Marshalls, TJ Maxx, Nordstrom Rack, I think carries this. I want to say I got this from Nordstrom Rack and this is like the 30 mil or 40 mil. This is the 40 mil size. Now that when I go ahead and restock this, I'm definitely getting the larger one because I love it so much that um I need the larger size 100 percent But it is such a great fragrance. So this is Jimmy Choose Illicit. It has a little bit of ginger bitter orange jasmine sombak this is from 2015 as well so it's got a little bit of that the ginger note and it's so funny because i hate ginger as a <laughs> i hate ginger in my food and i can automatically like tell the difference when something has ginger in it but ginger as a fragrance note like just creates something very beautiful in some fragrances not all of them this has ginger it's got the jasmine sombak in it it's got the bitter orange it's got a honey, it's got an amber, it's got a caramel. It's a little bit of a gourmand. It's a floral fragrance, but you can smell like the depth in it. You can smell a little bit of the, the honey, the caramel. Like it brings it down kind of very, um, not like super sweet, but very sweet. So it opens up with this nice little floral opening and then it kind of dries down and it, it pulls into the sexy. The honey and the caramel makes it super sexy. So that is Jimmy Choo's Illicit and what, what do we have? We already know what the... Have we not figured out what the pattern is here yet? Here's the pattern. The 4 ounce and the 8 ounce body cream is going to be titled A Sexy and Illicit Affair. A sexy and an illicit affair with your favorite fragrance. Hello? What, we, what do you think we were talking about over here? Your favorite fragrance. So, I have a 4 ounce and a 8 ounce body cream Jimmy Choo's Alyssa is bomb. If you don't know anything about it, get the sample. The fragrance cream is, the body cream is super close to it. It smells bomb. First of all, I'm not putting out anything. Do I look like I smell good? Okay. So just so you know, I, I'm not going to put out anything where we both don't feel like and look like we smell good, okay? I'm just saying. So a sexy and illicit affair, four ounces and eight ounces, is currently available on the website. I don't know what number we're on. I done lost track. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. We are on number seven. Number seven is that's my honorable mention. Let's not do that. Number seven is going to be. I'm gonna get a bit of bigger bottle because this one's gonna just stay in my purse. This is Lancome's Idol. Listen, 
I did a fragrance view on Lancome Doll. I am not going to give you, I'm not going to give you the notes. I, what I'm going to say is this. If you wear it, it's great for day, like no matter what, but it's perfect for night. It's perfect for a nighttime, sexy, confident, strong, I just want to show up. I want to be present. I want to be in your space type of mood. That's what this is for. This is Lancome's doll. This is number seven. Get the sample. I'm going to tell you, this is one of those ones I would say try this sample. It's not as straightforward and um, everyday like Marc Jacobs Perfect. It has a little bit of a note in here that I think that everybody should experience and see whether or not it fits on their body. So I'm going to tell you, go ahead and sample it and then decide you want to get it. You'll get it. So, if you go over to lovedavis.com, how many times did I mention lovedavis.com? Did I sponsor my own video? Hmm. All idols are fearless. That's what it makes me feel like. This, to me, eludes, exudes, exudes or eludes, exudes confidence, sexiness, fearlessness. It's a great spring nighttime fragrance, okay? A great spring nighttime fragrance. All idols are fearless, okay? That is going to be... Lancome's Hidal. Number eight. Number eight is going to be none other than the heavy hitter. Madison Avenue by Bond, the House of Bond, the House of Bond number nine. The rhubarb. The House of Bond number nine. This big girl fragrance right here i did a whole review on this i'm telling you right now i have yet to have a bond that i would i have not loved even the one that's peaking right here i have grown to love i have grown to love those grass notes fragrances she's not in this video because she's in the grass notes fragrance video this one right here and she will definitely be in more videos this baby right here is definitely worth spring summer fall winter sexy moments day moments i gotta have it moments let me get your attention moments. Let me make a bitch mad moments. That is her. She is available over on lovedavis.com in the four ounce, eight ounce body cream and a candle. Okay. Madison Avenue. And I want to tell you that the title is, I should really put it up on my phone, but the title is something like, something about shopping on Madison Avenue. <laughs> ironically enough but anyway bond the house of bond number nine madison avenue and number nine is going to be a newbie to my collection this is dolce and gabbana's lempatrice lempatrice let me tell you this because i just got this fragrance i put this in here because i have it on today and i want to tell you right now it is you're gonna have to spray it a little heavy you're gonna have to my top is available over on lovedavis.com too. I'm just saying. We are branded. We are branded today. This is, this opens up a very fresh and fruity fragrance. And I cannot pull in the woody notes yet. So I know that it dries down to like a sandalwood, um, a musk and a sandalwood. I have not pulled that out yet. What I pull out immediately is the kiwi and watermelon. So it almost feels like a very light kiwi watermelon fragrance. But not like a Bath and Body Works. Not like a... Victoria's Secrets like it is a it is a good different type of fresh fruity fragrance if that makes sense that's all I'm gonna say about this for right now I'm gonna play with this a little bit more but it definitely belongs in this video it is the bomb okay and that is Dolce & Gabbana's L'Empatrice 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 it, it, it is. It's very different. It's not like a very regular. It's not like I put water, watermelon, and kiwi and shook it up and then decided to spray it and say, oh, let me add some alcohol and now it's a perfume. It's something extra and different about it. So it's really, really good. I was excited to go ahead and get my hands on this. And I got my hands on this off of FragranceNet.com for like 30 something dollars. I'm just saying. I'll put the link in the description box. And then number 10 is going to be none other than Ariana Grande's Cloud. 
I couldn't get that cloud out, could I? So Ariana Grande's cloud. Why do you have Ariana Grande's cloud? Because anybody who does not want to pay the $305 or $320 for Baccarat Rouge 540, go ahead and get Ariana Grande's cloud for $24.97 for one ounce. Um, which is also, is this 30 mil? Yeah, so this is also 30 mil. You can get this for $24.97 from Walmart. If you don't want to buy a Baccarat Rouge or if you want to decide if you want to get it later, go ahead and get this because this should be worn way more than Baccarat Rouge for $300. I only want to wear that on special occasions. This I can wear every day. It is very, very, very close. There are a million videos out about what, what how it, um, how it um, compares, but it definitely compares. And so that is what we have. So when I, I'm going to leave you with two things. Number one, I introduced what I call the gold collection. I have the Baccarat Rouge um, fragrance. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm tripping. I have the Baccarat Rouge 4 ounce and 8 ounce body cream. It is called Let's Play Baccarat, shall we? I wanted to say a game up, but it didn't got too long. This is the cream. In case you guys don't know what my cream looks like, this is exactly what it looks like. Like, it's it's bomb.com and good for you, girl. Like, it's not going to break you out. It's good for your skin. I did that. So that is the cream. All right. So that is the four. This is the four ounce and it comes in an eight ounce as well, which is this is the eight ounce jar. So there's a four ounce and an eight ounce. Again, this is definitely the ish. All right. This is actually the one that was in my purse. <laughs> but this, this is the four ounce and the eight ounce of the Baccarat Rouge 540. I will put that in the link. I'll put that link in the description box below. And let me show you the candle just so that you know. The candle comes in, this is why it's called, well, it's called the gold collection, but it's, this is the gold collection. As you can see, the label is gold, it's bomb. This is the 16 ounce candle for Baccarat Rouge 540. It's called Let's Play a Game of Baccarat. This is the 16 ounce candle. It is super bomb and good. Listen, that's the candle. Four ounce. Oh, where's the eight ounce? <laughs> while we're stacking them on top of each other and eight ounce this is the whole baccarat rouge collection over at lovedavis.com and you're gonna want it that's all i'm gonna say just go ahead and get it girl go ahead and get it if you want to know what it smells like go out and get the ariana grande cloud just go ahead and get it you know you know what just go ahead and get it anyway you're gonna love it this is a great blind buy just go ahead and get it Spring, summer, winter, fall, definitely spring right now. This this wears amazing on my skin, okay? Amazing. So, just so you know. So, I have a sample of Baccarat Rouge over here, my sample thing, um, <laughs> but, which I have been wearing. So, I've been interchanging, and I'm almost out of my sample, so I decided to start wearing on this a little bit until I get myself to get the bottle, but I will get the bottle very, very soon. And then I'm going to end the video with an honorable mention. This is one of my signature scents. I don't... I don't label a lot of my scents as my signature scent. This is one of my signature scents. At some point this year, I am going to put together a video of all of my... No, I'm not. I'm, that's a lie. And I don't want to lie to you. I am going to put together a video of what you should have as signature scents, if possible. I was going to do that at my 21 and 21 video. However, we are stuck at number 16, 15 or 16. I can't get to 21. No matter how hard I try, I cannot get to 21. Okay, I'm trying. I'm really trying to get to 21. I just added one more to 21. So I think I'm at 18 and I just, I'm just trying to get to 21, y'all. But I am going to record that 21 and 21. This... I had to put back on the list. I took it off. And this is Arlesian. This is Lassie Tan's Arlesian. If you've never heard me talk about Lassie Tan Arlesian, which I'm not sure I've talked about in 2021. I did not want to talk about this until I was able to get a second bottle. As you can see, this is my second or third bottle. This is where I am with it. This is Lassie Tan's Arlesian. It is discontinued. Every now and again, it pops up online. I was able to get my hands on it. I had no idea it was going out, but I've also heard that it went out before and came back again. So I am hoping that it comes out again. This came out in 2014 or 2016. This is literally my number one signature scent. Lassie Tons, Arlesian. Let me tell you what's in it, and we're going to end the video here. This is a... It is a floral, what is it? 
it's a floral but is it a fruity floral it's a floral woody musk that's weird as i don't know what i don't pull out any wood or any musk fragrances out of here well maybe a wood not a musk so i can see the floral musk but not the wood um i do know that it says that it has sandalwood in it i can't pull it down i get a lot of fruit initially but it is just so good and so well blended together like this is just everything in a fragrance if you can get your hands on this i promise 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 you you're not going to regret it if you guys know where i can get another bottle because i have not been able to do i've been able to get one bottle and then the girl sold out of the other ones that she had and i should have just ordered two at the same time i just say this is about 70 dollars um i got this this particular bottle from um the store i got this from la citan however i do have my the one that i just purchased Honestly, if this sounds weird, it's because I literally don't know where I left off because my camera got too hot and I had to give it, let it cool down and it ended up being 20 minutes later. So, 20 minutes later, Alicean by La Citan. If you guys can get your hands on it, please do. It is a great fruity um, fragrance and I suggest that it hits your wardrobe if possible soon 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 and that is it for me guys for this spring bombshell video so i've given you 10 fragrance i gave you my honorable mention which is one of my signature scents i feel like out of this category um or out of this this perfume collection i feel like jimmy choose i want you um is going to enter into one of my signature scents as well and um i definitely already had a space for madison avenue from bond number nine but bond has so many the house of bond has so many great fragrances it is my favorite fragrance house if you guys don't know it is my favorite fragrance house um to date and so yeah just stay tuned we've got a few more goodies coming from them soon anyway I am rambling. That is it. This video is probably already too long. That's it for me, guys. I will see you in the next video. If you love any of the fragrances that I've mentioned, if you have any questions about anything that I've mentioned, put it in the comment section below. I will meet you and greet you and speak to you there. All right, until next time, toodles noodles. Oh, make sure you subscribe. Are you subscribed? Have you subscribed? Are you watching me every day and you're not subscribed? We're trying to get to a thousand subscribers, guys, okay? I'm just trying to hit a thousand. A thousand, I can I can move the channel a little bit better. I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers. Let's get me there, okay? Bring a friend. Come on over, bring a friend. Make sure you turn on the notifications and make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Peace.